Hello and welcome back to the next installment of this series in the scenario Elephants and Tigers and here's the elephants everybody, uh, the elephant everybody's talking about which we are trying to get. Now um, I have identified strong enemy positions on this ridge um, machine gun positions mostly. There's probably a mortar over there somewhere from how it sounds and uh, these guys here are under heavy mortar fire and will retreat um, where my light, whereas my light mortar will keep uh, shelling the Germans a bit. While this is happening I'm trying to work the flanks of this position because it's clearly a bit too strong. So for one thing these guys will slowly advance behind this ridge here and then you know flank that position and doing this they will be uh, supported by this Humber 3 scout car which I will pull out of this position here and through here and at the same time my carrier force here will start advancing down this road the heavy machine gun will be put into one of these buildings here uh, they don't have uh, a position on top uh, on the second floor, maybe in here. That could be a good position to uh, to support in advance here, but it's hard to tell. Anyway, um, and the scouts will advance here, make contact if the enemy is here with the enemy here, and um, if I think I can advance, I will um, pull up the third platoon which I have in reserve. There's also a position here in this weird open position. Maybe a machine gun covering this bridge. Hmm. Anyway, let's see if we can escape this mortar barrage. The Germans are still under heavy mortar fire, but it shouldn't go on for much longer. Ah, crap, he got wounded. I also have this forward squad in this copse of trees, which is using the brain gun to suppress them. Uh, this is not the best of all positions. Although I guess there's this little uh, hedge here, which is good. Anyway, my mortar barrage just ended. I know I, I told them to really open up on them, hopefully I can suppress them way better like that. That by the way I think is a mortar and I called in my own mortar mission on it. Problem is that only uh, the company HQ can see them so it will take a few minutes longer than if the forward observer would spot it. Over here my scouts are advancing. So far nothing. That seems to have kind of silenced them, but the... Shit. That was the recoilless gun, or... There yeah, are two at least. Um. Okay, I have uh, relatively successfully pulled back out of this uh, orchard. So there's that. Let's see, two inch mortar getting closer. I think that was the recallless gun again. Okay, over here. My scout troops are advancing. But can't see much so far, maybe I have to put them up here. My machine gun is being put into position in here. Uh, 
those recoilless guns. I wonder why I can't spot them. Over here, my scouts are advanced to here without coming under fire, so I'll put the rest of the platoon up here. Ah, that's good. Apparently, my company commander has reached the mortar team. Okay, these guys. Nah, don't just aim, shoot. Ah, he's wounded as well, that's annoying. Scout team looking in the wrong direction. I sure hope this route is safe, otherwise these are really bunched up. Where are they shooting at now? I seem to be relatively suppressed now. Although, of course, this mortar... Oh, we actually spotted, so we can shoot at it directly soon. That's a mean position. Maybe I can... Uh, no, with the machine gun I can spot it. I think. One second. I think it's my scouts that see it. Nah, I can't. Or maybe they can, actually. There's a bunch of trees in the way, though. Ah, uh, mortars are shooting again. I'm trying to get the mortar using my 2-inch mortar here. While these don't really do that much damage, I hope I can at least suppress them a bit. That being said, I really feel like I need a bit more support, like, a, like even one tank. Because in terms of firepower, my infantry is relatively crap, as is often the case with the uh, Commonwealth forces. Contact enemy armor. Here comes more two-inch mortar fire. Well, they are cowering. So far this flank seems relatively open. Hmm, apparently the mortars are ranged in. Okay. They are intermittently suppressed, but after that they usually pop up right away again. I want to pull these back a bit, because that position is way too exposed and this is, there's a bit better cover here. Shit. Yeah, see, that's what I meant. <sighs> Stupid recoilless guns. Since when can they shoot there? Did they move them? They must be here somewhere. I know where the next mortar barrage is landing. Oh, 
I wonder if they're at that hatch as well. well probably I would have seen them. They are suppressed? Damn it. Whoa, yeah. When reviewing the last round I noticed that this position is actually under fire from the recoilless gun. So I'm going to make a run for it. Because I have actually managed to get troops down to the river here. That being said... Oh, stupid. If I... If I don't get rid of those recoilless guns, I can't really come. I can't really advance. It's uh, these are basically what's holding me up right now. And what's annoying is that I can't spot them, which I think is pretty stupid, considering they have a huge backblast and would probably kick up a lot of dirt and Fire dust and smoke. Fresh. But oh. okay. Anyway, I will bombard this whole area with mortars again, and hopefully. Oh shit. Uh, that was a good hit. Okay, so that squad's useless now. Over here, where my scouts are, I noticed there are actually Germans at this hedge as well. Crap. Stupid machine guns. Also, my uh, mortar strike was very inaccurate, probably because it was called in by a platoon guy. Oh, light tank. One second. Maybe I actually saw that. Let's rewind it. Okay, there seems to be a, uh, an anti aircraft vehicle of some sort. Yep. 37 millimeter slug. Oh, that won't, won't help. Me, I mean, the Germans, it will help. Hello, oh, there I'm crossing the ri river. Out. Okay, and the artillery strike is done, so I can call in a new one on the main position here. To finally get that out of the way. I hope I can at least knock out the recoilless guns. That would help a lot. Because that would. Uh, allow, for example, my uh, armored cars to move way more uh, aggressively. Hmm. Seems like I have found a kind of an opening here. Although I wouldn't really rely on it too much. Especially now that this thing is here. I wonder if I can maybe get a mortar on this as well. Although to be honest I called in a mortar strike here with the rest of the ammunition to take off the recoilless guns. the best position. This position has been quiet for a while. I wonder if they have actually retreated, although these two are still active. I think the... Um, uh, yeah, it's on the move. The thing is, these kind of have to turn around to shoot at me, so with some luck I might be able to, to shoot at them first. Hello, They're certainly going into a relatively exposed position. Oh 
Okay. Okay, they are under fire. I mean, they're not armored, so I should be able to get at least some hits there. Oh shit. Yeah, they saw something. Oh, they saw the armored car. Damn it. But ah, shit. That's my crossing team as well. Okay, yeah, that was the armored car. I have my light mortars on it, though. Shit, what the are they aiming at now? Probably my infantry over there, which is very exposed. Crap. This could go horribly wrong. I told everything that can see it to shoot only at this thing. To maybe get... I mean, they have to get some hit at one point. Yeah, I think they're freaking them out over it. The AI is confused or something. Oh, man, my heavy mortar... or well, medium mortars are coming in as well soon. Yeah, they're retreating. Ah, okay, I got a hit. Ah, they're still aiming. And another hit, nice, okay. Machine gun in this direction as well. And okay, they're bailing out nice. Okay, well, that thing's useless now. Okay, at least something goes right. And here come my mortars now. That hopefully will suppress or maybe even destroy the recoil of guns. Okay. That's the last of my mortar rounds. And that will hopefully knock out those stupid recoil of guns. I mean, they must be here somewhere. Hello, rounds complete. While I'm doing this, I'm fanning out from my little bridgehead here. There's at least some cover here. Shit, now they're under fire as well. I wonder from where? From here. Ah, one was hit. Hmm, how can I get there relatively safely? Probably behind here. And then attacking here. Uh, anyway, uh, that was another 15 minutes, so I'm gonna call it a day now. Ah. Ah, they're retreating. Although I think that was the vehicle crew. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna uh, call it a day now. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching and have a nice day.